In this short video, I will be talking about what Oracle Autonomous Linux is and demonstrate how easy it is to get an autonomous Linux instance up and running and ready for you to develop your applications without having to worry about keeping your Linux security and bug fixes up to date. The idea of Oracle Autonomous Linux is to bring autonomous capabilities to Oracle Linux, such as automatically handling common management tasks, with a goal of helping to remove OS management complexity, human error, and manual management. In effect, that would help increase OS reliability, security, and operational efficiency at the lowest cost. Oracle Autonomous Linux is not a new Linux distribution. It is an Oracle Linux image with built-in autonomous management capabilities, and in the current release, it includes self-patching capabilities, and additional autonomous capabilities will be added in upcoming releases. It leverages Oracle Case Slice technology that performs automatic zero downtime updates on the kernel and key user space libraries, and it also applies automatic YUM updates on Oracle Linux for Oracle Cloud core libraries and utilities, and it also includes updates to pre-installed dependency packages, such as for Oracle Database, Enterprise Manager, and Oracle Cloud Infrastructure Tools. Autonomous Linux patching is run on a daily basis, and it's also integrated with Oracle Cloud notifications, where you can set it up to notify you, such as with email or pager duty alerts, and you are alerted of any case splice or YUM updates that have occurred, or where there have been case splice known exploit detections. Oracle Autonomous Linux is based on the proven Oracle Linux operating environment, which is a high-performance, secure, reliable, and scalable Linux distribution for enterprise workloads. Oracle Linux powers Oracle Cloud and Oracle Engineered Systems and is used extensively by tens of thousands of customers globally and is certified to run software from thousands of ISVs. So how do you get started? We make it really easy for you to get your autonomous Linux instance up and running in Oracle Cloud so you can start developing your applications without having to worry about patching your Linux instances as autonomous Linux will automatically take care of applying your security and bug fixes each day. What makes things even better is that Oracle Cloud includes Oracle Autonomous Linux and Oracle Linux Premier support at no additional cost to you when using Oracle Cloud infrastructure. Just get your free Oracle Cloud infrastructure account and you can also take advantage of Oracle Cloud free tier resources in which the always free tier resources are available to you with no time limit to try out Oracle Autonomous Linux. Next, I will demonstrate how easy it is to get started and deploy Oracle Autonomous Linux on Oracle Cloud infrastructure. When you log into your Oracle Cloud infrastructure account, you can either navigate from compute to instances, or alternatively, you can use a quick action to create a virtual machine instance. This will take you to the Create Compute Instance interface. From here, you can provide your compute instance with a name, and then you'll notice that the Oracle Linux image is defaulted for your compute instance. You can change that by clicking on Change Image, and this will take you to Platform Images. And from here, you can select Oracle Autonomous Linux. You will need to specify your availability domain, your Oracle Cloud infrastructure shape, and as well, the networking details. And finally, you can insert your SSH keys. And then click on Create. And this will go off and immediately start provisioning and creating your Oracle Autonomous Linux instance. Within minutes, your Oracle Autonomous Linux instance is up and running and you can SSH into it and start using it. If you wish to set up notifications to let you know an update has occurred, you can set up notifications by navigating to application integration and notifications and creating a topic which is a communication channel for sending messages to its subscribers. Subscribers will be notified with the chosen method whenever a message is published to a topic. It is recommended that the topic be configured prior to creating the instance since topic information needs to be configured as part of the cloud init script when creating the instance. 
To conclude, here are some resources and ways in which you can stay connected with Oracle Linux and Oracle Autonomous Linux. Try out Autonomous Linux today and take the work out of patching your Linux systems.